Oh, baby. Yeah. That was nuked. I see a 148 smash. So. Those are pretty good. <laughs> pretty good. The new Titleist TSR2 drivers are faster, longer, and straighter. But how do they compare to the past Titleist drivers? Today, we've got the past four generations of Titleist drivers, and we're going to see what TrackMind tells us. Hey golfers, I'm Drew Mahol, the Second Swing Golf, joined by Danny Farrell, Master Club Fitter at Second Swing. We're on the driving range today with a lot of drivers. Uh, we've got four Titleist drivers, each of the past four generations, beginning here with the new TSR2 and going back to the 917D2, Danny. Yeah. So uh, usually some high MOI drivers here from Titleist in this category, but a lot to be excited about with TSR2 in particular here. Absolutely. Obviously, it looks like we got our hands full, Yeah, right? We, we got do. four different drivers. We're going to be going back in the past a little bit. One of my favorite heads for spin, the 917 mm -hmm. series. Mm -hmm. Nowadays, there's not much that does spin anymore. Right. So we'll see that today as well. We'll see the forgiveness. Now, we're also gonna be tuning in the new shaft mm -hmm. from the TSR line as well. The 10 Psi 1K, we're mm -hmm. gonna be using that a lot today yep. too. So we'll probably lead out with the 917, yep. start older, work into the new stuff as yeah. well. Yeah, so. a couple things to key in on a little bit on the technology side mm -hmm. for TSR2, that multi-plateau VFT face design. Yes. A uh, lot of consistent ball speed across that whole face, as you can kind of see progressing mm -hmm. through older to newer models, they really refined that club face. Right. And then just looking on the sole, that, that TSR2, so clean, She's so dirty. pure. Mm -hmm. um, cleaner aerodynamics as well. So maybe yeah. a little bit of club speed pickup. I think it, today won't be a perfect science to measure that, but <laughs> right. um, you know, there is th uh, something to be said about how much cleaner that bottom of that club looks uh, with, with TSR2. So those are kind of the yeah. two key innovations we'll maybe watch for today, but I think sure. overall, per the you know, forgiveness, high launch, overall performance, I think we'll look for that as we go uh, from, I guess, the older drivers to the newer drivers. Absolutely, and one big thing I'm starting to realize just looking at the heads is the scoring lines. You know I'm yeah. big on oh, that. Yeah. So going back, one, two, three, there's five there. Yep. Okay, in the 917 series. In the TS series, there's five there. Yep. The TSI series, how do you think? Four? Four. And where do you think we are now? Down to three. three. There Ooh. we go. There so we go. things have changed a little bit cosmetically as well for Titleist, just to illuminate that sweet spot a little mm -hmm. bit more, help with alignment, help find the middle a little bit more often. So Drew, you ready to get to work? Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. A little pushy until the back gets loosened up. Looking down at this, Drew, it goes back a long ways. I would imagine that's probably going to be something cosmetically that's definitely going to change today. Seeing the gray finish out of black, obviously that's a big change too, but 917 D2, so a little spinnier head as well. Nine and a half degrees aloft, so that changed too. Yeah. So, oh, yeah, first one felt that. pretty good. Not bad. There you go. Does that one hit good? Looks like it. Oh, it's all right. Fairway technically on here, so. <laughs> okay. Trackman fairway might be a little bit generous, but. <laughs> I'll take it. Oh, baby. Yeah. That definitely got straight up in the air. It's gotta be the longest so far. That was a good ball. Here we go. It's turning. <laughs> yeah, yeah. There's a little bit of left out there. Interesting on that one. Oh yeah, that's still got out there a good ways. Yeah. Different sound for sure. Oh yeah. A lot, a lot more muted. Mm -hmm. I do like the shape though, even from the two. You can tell it's smaller. It's like right in between the two and three from last year. Yeah. So it, it's gonna fit a lot more players' eyes this year. That was good. How's that one? That was nuked. I see a 148 smash, so. That was pretty good. <laughs> pretty good. All right, so Danny, a um, lot of good tee shots there with uh, <laughs> Titleist drivers. So um, we did have to kind of manipulate a little bit because of this, the standard loft. Some Titleist mm -hmm. drivers did change yeah. at the TSI line. 
they went from kind of the eight and a half, nine and a half, ten and a half degree, degree to cadence to the yep. nine, ten, eleven. Right. Um, so, you know, whole numbers, if you will. So we did have <laughs> sure. to ma manipulate that a little bit. All of them were at nine and a half degrees of loft after a couple adjustments to the TSI and TSR line. So, mm -hmm. with mm -hmm. that said, let's start at the nine seventeen D two, okay. kind of comparing to the TSR two. Any big differences there? Uh, a lot of difference. Yeah. Uh, visually, for me. I wasn't a fan of that. It looked like it stretched a long way back. Yeah. So yes, it raised the forgiveness level for me, but shape-wise, I didn't get along with it mm -hmm. very well. Sure. Sound was definitely amplified. It was louder here yeah. as well, which I would expect. Um, and I would expect a little bit more spin too, but you'll see on the track, man, it's the only one where the face was more open yeah. as well. So that'll influence spin sure. too. Yep, yep, yep. But compared to the 917 to the new TSR, I picked up three miles an hour with the TSR picked up three points in the efficiency. There you go. Picked up a little bit more consistency. Didn't notice the launch for me was the highest so far with the TSI 2. Okay. But TSR was in a more manageable window, more yep. optimal flight window for me. And a little bit more consistent as well. Yep. So I like that. I like the more stable flight as well. Uh, but between 917 and TSR, I picked up 11 yards in carry and about nine out the back door. Okay. Okay. So it was better. And we can see on track, man, not my best day. You can no, see I don't I like mean, to see things go right too much. Yeah, yeah, that's <laughs> but, fine. I mean, but, but I think it's, were good. We, we like to see the horizontal oval, though, you know. Absolutely. And that's what I think with the TSR2 there you see. And then kind of moving into TS2, I know you got, oh, this, that's probably the smallest oval, actually, was yeah. the TS2. Mm -hmm. um, uh, or the TSI2, one of those both two. Of them, yeah. uh, but they're both kind of over on the left a little bit, which is your shot, kind of that draw a little bit. Yep. But uh, talk about TS2 versus TSR2. So the TS2, yeah. um, they kind of went back away from the gray, back right. into the black. Uh, yep. So what do you think visually? And then maybe talk about some, if there's any numbers that- I, I thought it was a lot better visually for me. Um, it just seemed like I was shut in the face a little bit more with that combination. Okay. Um, it just wasn't my, my favorite. Yeah. You know, especially um, going back a few years, I would go to the 917 for more spin. Okay. And then I would go to the TSI line to kill a little bit of it. So, okay. you know, that TS kind for me is there. that tweener club. Yeah, okay. Yeah, because yeah. Yeah, we've talked about before how the Titleist, you know, as they've gone through the speed project, they've really done mm -hmm. a great job of lowering spin for those golfers that need lower spin at the ball further. Right. Um, there are golfers, however, out there that do need more spin. And so right. that's where you them. as the fitter <laughs> yeah. kind of need to find that happy medium there. So right. um, now TSI and TSR now, let's kind yes. of wrap up with that. So TSI, um, this is where that they made that change in the standard lofts, but yep. what did you think of, you know, you talked a little bit about the look getting a little bit more compact yes. with TSR there. Yeah, so I definitely was a fan of the TSR2 look. Yeah. It was more of that in-between TSI2 and 3 shape for me. And you brought up the speed project, take a look, it was the fastest I swung today, yep. even after all these swings so far. <laughs> so <laughs> ball speed was the fastest, club speed was the fastest. I mean, that's two out of the three that titles is claiming this yep. new driver is. Yep. Faster, straighter, longer, yep. right? So straighter, yes, I found more fairways. Yeah. Uh, further, yep, by 11 yards. Um, same thing with TSI, I picked up 11 yards on there as well. Matched it on the total back end as well. But a little bit more ball speed, a little bit more consistent as yep. well. So yeah. all the things that should have happened with the TSR, it did. So cool. it was great, really great to see that. Yeah, and I think it's also cool to note that, you know, while the TSR is performing really well for you mm -hmm. and it looks like it's going to be a great winner for golfers yes. as a new item, yeah. you still see really good stuff from the older Titleist drivers as Absolutely. well. So that's kind of the cool thing about being a second swing is, um, you know, if somebody wants a used fitting, that might mm -hmm. save a little bit of dough. Mm -hmm. We've got the TSI2, we got the yeah. TS2, we got the 917D2 that are all right. great options. Right. Or if you're looking to really, you know, get something brand new, uh, mm -hmm. really you know, ultimate performance, right? Yep. TSR2 can be yep. a model for you as well. So we got all of them that you Absolutely. need here at Second Swing. Absolutely. So life's good with the Titleist product. Any questions going on with kind of the information we've downloaded so far? No, I think, I think, I mean, that's pretty cut and dry right there. You <laughs> get a little bit of distance yeah. with TSR2, yep. a little bit more consistency. Yep. Um, but again, all are great options for golfers. Yep. And if they're interested, right, mm -hmm. they know where to go. Absolutely. Scheduling a Come fitting at Second Swing, see someone like Danny, yep. get in the fitting bay and get all your numbers dialed in and make sure you know which Titleist driver, whether it's a new TSR or whether it's one of the previous generations, is right for your swing. So Danny, thanks for joining today, swinging a few times <laughs> right. and getting us some good data. You got it, you got it. We'll see you next time.